Google has released material icons and material symbols that you can use for free. Last year, Google released their material icons for open source use. They're one of the most popular font icons because they're free to use and they're designed to be minimal and universally recognizable, making them extremely versatile. And there are five different styles. There's outlined, filled, rounded, sharp, and two-tone. Going through these, you can click on one and then you can change the density export it at double the size. You can change it to a light mode or dark mode, black or white. And then you can copy and paste the CSS. You can also export it as an SVG, a PNG, or what's even cooler is they've just added the Figma file. So you can head over to figma.com community and you can duplicate this directly to Figma so you can use all of these icons in your designs. This year, Google has shared their new material symbols, which is an adjustable variable font icon that allows for further granular customization of their icons. This puts all of their icon symbols into one font file. You can still download the code here and export them as SVGs or PNGs if you'd like. The best part though, is that there's an amazing plugin for Figma, which is great if you wanna have them on hand to use in your static mockups. After you grab it from the community and install it, you can jump into Figma and then head over to your plugins and you'll see the material symbols option. From here, you can search for an icon, you can change the fill, you can change the weight, and you can just drag that right into your design, drop it into your auto layout, change a color or two, and you're ready to rock. And if you want to learn more about best practices and how to actually apply these in your designs, check out the design guide. This talks about design principles of system icons, do's and don'ts, yeses and no's of using them, and how to apply them in grids, layouts, and your own application design. So this is an incredible resource that you have got to take advantage of. Now, Google has a lot of other cool resources that I've covered on this channel. So if you want to know about those, watch this video next because it will show you some other incredible free resources. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.